Hi there, Roberto here with Top One Marketing again with another tutorial video. And in this tutorial video, we're going to show you how to remove the background from a video, specifically a solid uh, colored background like a black background. In this case, we're going to be removing the uh, black background from a countdown timer. Um, I know that you can find countdown timers online uh, with a transparent background already, but there might be a case where you found a countdown timer that's got a special font or a nice font that you really like, and the, the only way that you got it was with a solid color background, and you want to remove that, okay? Uh, I'm going to show you quickly how to get that done. So without further ado, let's get into this. So first thing we're going to do is you can see here, just a good example. Um, I have a, a, a video here um, for like a pre live uh, video, um, you know, a video that you might, you know, insert in there. Um, so that the guests can look at uh, a couple minutes or a couple seconds before you go live. And so I have this countdown timer that I had acquired right here. Um, it's a green font, but it's got a black background. So we are in DaVinci Resolve. Um, so it's a it's a free it's a free application. Um, you can download it and use it. So you can consider this uh, DaVinci Resolve tutorial as well, okay? So here is the uh, the um, countdown timer on there, okay? You can see that it is um, with the black background, all right? And so what we want to do is we want to remove that background. And so we could do that real easy. Um, you don't have to get nervous or, or you know, anything like that. This is this is really, really, really easy. Okay. So I'm in the edit tab right here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into the fusion tab. And in this fusion tab, you can see um it's right here. You have a media in and a media out, and they're connected. So what you want to do is you want to right click in here and you want to go to insert a tool and then you're going to slide over down to the mate and then you're going to go to Luma Keyer. And what that's going to do is it's going to insert uh, that insert that uh, node in there in between these two. And so you can see right here, boom, it automatically um, changed, I mean, removed the background. So if we go back to the edit tab, you can see that it removed the background. Now, you can go like right there and you can see it removed the background. Now you can notice that it has a level of transparency Okay, it's got a level of transparency there. Uh, you can see it right there. See how it's got the level of like transparency there. Let's go ahead and lower that real quick. Okay, it's got like some transparency going. So you can go back to the fusion tab and this little handle right here underneath the luminum, luminous channel you take the, the the one on the right and you slide it over and it starts to make the color in the font solid. So we go back to the edit tab so we can take a look at it and now it removed the transparency, okay? Um, now you notice that there's some blur around, okay? Um, I'll show you how to clean that up uh, quickly, um, you know, pretty nicely, okay? Go back to the Fusion tab and take this handle here 
and just move it just a little bit that way to the right. Go back to the edit tab. You can see that it's gone. It's still a little blur in between these little things right here, but I don't think that, you know, that is, you know, uh, too big of a deal there, right? And so we go right here to the solid color and take a look at what it looks like in the solid color right here, okay? So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Um, that is how you remove the backgrounds, the solid color backgrounds uh, from a, a video, uh, particularly a countdown timer. So if this video was helpful and you would like to receive um, notifications every time we drop another video like this, another tutorial video, um, please give us a like, give us a share, and subscribe to our channel. Click the notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload one of these awesome tutorial videos. So thank you, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.